This video is on changing the airbag computer for a 2015 to 2017 Ford Focus. And this is the airbag computer. It's sec secured with three screws. Um, one, two, and three in that corner right there. And there are two plugs that plugs in right right there. And it's seated, it's seated in the car just like this. So you've got to remove this one screw here and the two bolts in the back. And there's a clip you got to push in on the cable. And there's a lever. Once you push in the clip, you can slide the lever back and that cable release on both the same. Um, okay. And the actual computer is located right here. And the way you get it out is this panel is secured with just one clip here and it just goes to there so basically what you've got to do is pull from under here to release that clip and then this whole panel right here just slides forward like that and you take it out you can't break this this is normal you just pull with some force here as i'm doing pull it out and then you just slide the whole thing forward and that's it it comes out then you're going to have this ac vent here you pull this duct out from the bottom it's secured here in the bottom it's and then you just wiggle it and it comes out at the top that's all it is is a plastic and this is the airbag computer right here just slide this cable out the wheel and there's one bolt here there's one there in the front like I showed you and one in the back you're gonna need like a quarter inch um, tin ratchet to take it out this one is too big um, this is a three-quarter, but you're going to need a quarter inch with about a, um, a long socket to get it out. So you would do basically just like this and get them out. You want to socket the... Okay, I just re loosened the first bolt. Now I can just pull it off with my hand. The remainder of the way and that's one these are the ones in the rear and there's one actual screw that goes in the one in the front right here okay I just removed all three these are the two in the rear basically in this position and this is the one in the front right here in this position which they would be seated on the actual module like this I'm gonna put the module in place so you'd have this one in the front and the two bolts, the two bolts in the back, just like this. So I was able to do that with a three quarters um, wrench, number 10, but um, it's a lot easier, more comfortable with a uh, quarter inch, a smaller one. So I'm about to pull out the uh, actual cables now, which as I said, there's a, a clip and then you slide the lever backwards. I did the first one and now I'm releasing the second one. Now I just released them both and you got to pick up the module because it's on the rear end screws which I just did. I picked them up and you just slide it out and as you can see from here you can actually see the uh, the cables this is the clip from the back that I'm pushing down and then these levers is actually the release so once I've pushed that clip I was able to slide these levers back and release the cables you normally wouldn't pull this module out with those cables still there I just did that to show you guys so here it is I got it out and as you can see there are two different sizes so you can't mix it up so just gonna insert the uh, replacement now and you just re reverse the steps and that's it yeah as I said you just reverse the steps so you want to reinsert this duct this is for the AC you know you put it back in place and then on this panel what you want to do is to um, you can do this release from here and you're gonna basically get the uh, let me release that okay I just released the uh, clips on the back and you just pull it up and slide it out 
and then you're gonna get this clip, this pin. So all you gotta do is slide this back in place, um, and then you push the clip in, and the clip is actually gonna clip into this hole here. Yeah, so you would do this, slide it back in place, and push the clip in here, and then you just put this cover back into place, and that's it, you're done. And these instructions apply to all 2015 through 2017 Ford Focus, but it would most likely also work for 2012 to 2014. It should be the same position.